Hi, my name is Max Evans and I work for Rogers O'Brien Construction and I'm your office engineer for the new T.A. Brown Elementary. I'm here today to talk to you about drones and how we use them in construction out in the field for logistics, mapping, and progress photos. So most of you already know about drones, but I'm going to talk to you today about how we utilize them for construction. Um, so out in the field, we take the drone and we have a set path that it takes the same photos on each flight and it's called project progress photos. And we use these photos to show the owner how the project is progressing throughout the, the life cycle. We also have another app that we utilize that takes photos straight down on the project and stitches them all together and creates a map. This map's called an ortho mosaic, and it's a scaled map of your project from all the photos that it stitched together that we can then use and look at our project and use it for planning for logistics, coordination, safety meetings, um, how would we like to have deliveries brought into the project. Um, we can use this to show subs where they're going to start their work on the project. Um, it's a very big tool that we use out in the field. So after we connect the drone, um, we set it on a flight path. We've got multiple different flight paths we take at different altitudes. Um, we call these flight paths progress photos, and we use these progress photos to take the same photo from the same angle every single time we take a flight. Um, this is an autonomous flight path, and that means that the drone has an app that takes off and flies all by itself and comes back around and lands on the ground without any control by the pilot. That means I'm basically just there just in case something happens that I need to land the drone if a helicopter or something else were to get in the way. So the drone we use is called a Phantom 4 Pro and the way it works is we connect my phone to the controller and then the drone turns on and has a GPS. So when you set the drone on its automatic flight path, it has a GPS in it that tells it exactly where to go and stop for these project progress photos. From there, it can also have sensors on it so it avoids cranes or trees, light poles, and all kinds of other obstacles so that it doesn't run into them or have any incidents. So the drone we use has a 4K camera that we can use to take videos around the project and then we can send these out to the owner. Um, these videos are good for videos like this and for progress updates to the owner. They're good for coordination with the subs and they're also just fun to look at. 